Dear students, today I am going to deliver my e-lecture on the topic entitled Contingent Crop Planning for Aberrant Weather Conditions. Students, you all know that the southwest monsoon accounts for nearly 75% of the natural precipitation which is received in the country and it exerts a strong influence on the Kharif food grain production as well as on the economy in terms of agricultural output and farmers income. This onset of southwest monsoon and the amount of rainfall and its distribution are the crucial factors which influence the performance of agriculture. In rainfed areas, as a general rule, early sowing of crops with the onset of monsoon is the best bet practice that gives high reliable yield. But the crop yield is affected due to delay in monsoon or sometimes prolonged breaks during the cropping season and also there are chances of early withdrawal or continuation of monsoon for longer periods. These apparent situations often lead to the poor crop performance or the total crop failure in most of the major crops. So there is a need to develop appropriate strategies to deal with such eventualities. So coming to the topic, contingent crop planning for aberrant weather condition. Let us understand the meaning of the word contingent. What does it mean? The word contingent means any future event or the circumstance which is possible but cannot be predicted with certainty. Students, you might have seen that on the normal onset of monsoon when crops are sown in the conserved moisture and during the early growth, any unexpected or unfavorable weather abnormality like long dry spell of 3 to 6 weeks, drought or early cessation of monsoon may occur. This unexpected or accidental occurrence of unfavorable weather after sowing is known as the contingency and the crop planning to overcome this contingency is called contingency crop planning. So student, contingency planning refers to mitigate or reduce any such unexpected, unusual, unfavorable and hence unwanted accidental weather situations occurring at any time without prior knowledge before the crops are sown or even after the crops are sown. Here, uh, what does it mean that unusual or unexpected weather when the crops are sown or before the crops are sown when we are when we are talking about the period before the crops are sown it means that the unfavorable situation uh, is your uh, delayed onset of monsoon and after the crops are sown this includes the draw prolonged dry spells during the crop growing period so students, but is the definition of the contingent crop planning. So contingent crop planning we will define it as the planning of the cropping system under aberrant weather conditions such as delay of the onset, erratic monsoon, rainfall distribution to meet the requirement of food, fodder and grain of the farmers as well as the state. Or you can also define it as making available a plan for providing alternative crop or cultivars or varietal choice which should be in tune with the actual rainfall situation and the soils in a given location. Hence the contingent crop planning therefore is proposed to mitigate such a situation through the choice of appropriate crop and varieties, cropping systems or necessary relevant farm practices. Now, to develop a contingency plan for a particular area, a detailed study of 
the rainfall data should be done first based on this rainfall data the planning should be done and in any area generally one or the two of the rainfall situations may occur and these rainfall situations are rainfall abrasions are delayed onset of monsoon normal onset of monsoon which is followed by immediately prolonged dry spell mid season drought early cessation of rains are extended monsoon now what are the effects of rainfall abrasion on the crops now there are different rainfall abrasion which uh, we have uh, read in the previous slide like delay in the onset of monsoon early cessation of rains and intermediate dry spells which includes dry spell immediately after sowing dry spell at vegetative phase dry spell at flowering and dry spell at ripening now what will be the effect of these rainfall abrasion on the crops now when there is a delay in the onset of rainfall then the length of the cropping duration cropping season or the cropping duration is reduced because when the crop sowing is delayed there is a reduction in the length of the cropping season and which is going to affect our yield now early withdrawal or cessation of rainfall at because of the early cessation there might be chances of moisture stress at maturity and the hence the grain filling is affected likewise intermediate dry spells which also occur during the different crop growing period this dry spell may be immediately after the sowing of the crop which includes uh, the the less germination of the crops poor plant population and hence the growth of the plant is affected likewise if this dry spell will be at vegetative phase it will affect the growth of the plant there will be uh, poor stem elongation there will be less leafy area expansion and at the same time there will be reduction in branching or the tilling of the plant so if this dry spell occur at flowering stage it will affects the anthesis and the pollination uh, at the same time the grain and the pod number will also get reduced likewise at ripening stage if this prolonged dry spell uh, is there then the grain filling is affected and which is uh, which which results in the reduction in the grain size and hence the poor yield so students we have uh, till now we have studied about the contingent crop planning what what is the meaning of the word contingent contingent crop planning definition and what are the different rainfall situations which you can rainfall abrasions which uh, affects our crop and those rainfall abrasions are delay in the onset of rainfall early withdrawal or cessation of rainfall and then intermediate dry spells like immediately uh, dry spell uh, immediately after sowing dry spell at vegetative phase dry spell at flowering or dry spell at ripening now in our second uh, video uh, which i am going to post shortly uh, uh, in in which we will study about the different interventions which we can uh, do to mitigate or to reduce the ill effects of these rainfall abrasions on our crop plants thank you dhanyawad